I'm back uh, with another video, hair dye video. I'm going to try to um, put some streaks in my hair. Um, I know you guys seen the video where I dyed my hair and it came out like orange. Well, this is what it faded to. Um, it's like a brownish color when it hits the light. Sometimes it looks orange. I'm going to be trying to put, I don't know if y'all can see that, blonde streaks in my hair. I'm just going to do it um, at home. This is Dark and Lovely Luminous Blonde 396. I really hope, really, really, really hope that I don't mess up my hair. Um, but yeah, let's get into the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Um, I'm at 1K. 1K, y'all. I never thought I was going to make it, but I made it. Now my next goal is 2K. And then 3. And then 4. And then 5. But anyway, yeah, let's get into it. But this is my hair. It's like day three four hair um yeah I'm gonna just section it off I'm gonna try to make like the blonde more towards the tips and then in between but we'll see so I have my gloves honestly I never read the instructions um it's my hair if I mess up on it only person I can blame is me so I just go right in and don't look back so first thing I'm gonna do of course is I'm going to put the lightener into the cream developer. Um, and now we're going to put the color inside of the bottle. I am making such a mess, oh my God. If this don't come out right, it's my own fault because I'm being so messy. Shake, shake, shake. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take out one of the back sections. Like I said, I'm going to start on the back first. Okay, there we go. Whew, this is a lot. Okay. So. This is the second half. We're just gonna lay that down. Let's see how it looks. And we're gonna choose this piece. There's no method to this madness, guys. Fun part, guys. The fun part. Okay. I want some here, some here. I have no idea what I'm doing. That is gonna look a mess. I messed up. Okay. We can fix it. Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. So, what the heck did I do? I don't know. I don't know what I did. Okay.
And so, can y'all see that? I'm really about to just go through and like brush it through the ends a little bit. Whatever it hits, it hits. Whatever it doesn't, it doesn't. Probably not a good idea to dye the tips of your hair because they are the oldest, but I need a little bit of color in my life. Summertime got a hold of me. Y'all see my nails? I'm just like, do it. Do it or don't, whatever. It's just hair, it'll come back. I think, so I think that I coated most of the pieces that I think I need to. So I'm gonna just keep this in my hair for about 30 minutes, see if anything changes. If not, keep it in for 40 minutes, and then I'm gonna rinse it off. So yeah, I'll see you guys when I think this is all done. Oh. I don't know how to feel about this, y'all. I'm about to go wash it out um, and then I'll be back. My hair is going to be wet, of course, but I'll be back once it's all wet and washed out. So I'll be back. I just wanted to show you guys how it looked after 30 minutes of letting it process. Um, of course, y'all see the blonde in there, but this might be ugly for real, for real. So we're going to see. I'm about to go wash it out. So I'll see y'all in a second. Okay, so the hair's rinsed out. Um, washed it. Um, I'm about to put in my deep condition yo the back of it is really bright like I think I put way too much in the back but I'm about to put in my three minute miracle strong ten times stronger in one week plus um, deep conditioner from Aussie I use this every week love it love it love it um, since I just dyed my hair of course I want my curls to come back stronger than ever so I'm gonna rake this through smells so good and I'm looking at the viewfinder guys so I'm so so sorry again um, I might just rake this through my hair try to get it through everything um look how bright that is oh my gosh so once I'm done with this deep conditioner I'm just going to go ahead and put this on along with my Aussie um, 7 in 1 conditioner total miracle so once it's dry, I'll probably insert pictures on how it looks dry. Look at that. That is so bright. Wow. So I chose to come back on camera because I was trying to take pictures and it wasn't doing any justice. Um, so this is what the hair looks like after I put the blonde in it. So on top, it looks like I pretty much dyed my entire head blonde. And then underneath, of course, you can see my dark brown. So this is pretty much before and then after. And then the back, I missed a space. Like, I missed a big chunk. So I think I might have to go over it again. But this is after. Um, it's still a little wet in the ends right here. But this is after. And I think I like it, you know, um, I think it's cute, so yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching my video. Um, give this video a thumbs up, comment on it down below if you guys wanna see a styling video. And yeah, see you guys next time.